Did you know that you could dictate to Google Docs question mark? Open a brand new doc period. Now click on the tools menu period. And then finally click on the voice typing item period. This will bring up a microphone to your top left of your document period. And then you can just click on the microphone and start talking period. Google Docs is sitting there waiting for you to, to, to tell it to do something period. Now the voice commands in my case don't work as well as they should period. Most of the time punctuation commands do period. For example, I should be able to say select previous word. Period. You notice that it didn't do it for me period. I have gotten it to work in the past period but it's not necessarily reliable, period. So what you can do is use a combination of dictation and your keyboard and mouse, period. I've also noticed that it recognizes most of the punctuation marks for me, comma, but you have to remember to say them as you're talking, period. Similar to what you would do when you're talking to your phone if you're gonna dictate a text message to send to someone, period. Uh, one of the great features of this function, functionality, <laughs> period, whatever you want to call it, dot, 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 <clears throat> is to uh, make it record a transcript of a video that you're watching, period. Now, you have to go back and edit it to insert the uh, new lines or new paragraphs or punctuation, comma, but it does a pretty good job of recording a video and transcribing it for you period it's not something that you want to just set and let it go by itself comma because a lot of times you'll notice that a video has a pause in it period and sometimes that pause is just enough for the microphone to not detect that it's talking being talked to comma and then you can imagine what happens it just stops recording period then you have to go back and catch up to where it was and start it recording again period but it's better than paying a transcription service, period. Now, most, in most cases, it works pretty well regardless of dialect uh, or voice quality, I guess you would say, period. Theoretically, it would be training itself as you talk, comma, but it's more like us being trained to talk to it better, period. There are a ton of functions and features that you can use in the voice typing function of Google Docs. Uh, I'll include a link of those in the description of this video, period. Good luck, comma. I hope that you have learned something today, comma, and I hope that you find it valuable, period. If you do, please hit the like, subscribe, thumbs up, whatever good action buttons there are, comma. I sure would appreciate it, period. Be blessed, exclamation mark. I'll talk to you later, period. Bye-bye, period. Oh my goodness, I almost forgot, period. Imagine transcribing your video as you are recording your video, comma, and then using that transcription as the body in the description on your YouTube post, period. Now that's a great way to get some eyes on your stuff, comma, especially realizing that the YouTube search engine comma is probably the most powerful well comma the second most powerful search engine on the internet period it's only second to google period and a lot of times the google search engine includes everything that's in the youtube search engine period so if you have a document or a description full of good text about what you're talking about comma basically a transcription dot 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 then you have exactly what you need to get your video ranked up in the Google search engine, the YouTube search engine, period. Talk to you later, period. Bye-bye, period.